It's not acceptable that you don't have answers for these questions right now. These are the obvious problems that exist. Uh, in television, we don't allow the host of a, of a program to hawk a product to a child. It's illegal, you know? And I'm the author of those laws, so I know it's illegal. And the same thing is true here. Uh, why Facebook just can't say flat out, no, we won't allow influencers uh, to, do, be, to, to be trying to push a child towards buying something uh, because that child has now seen a video. It's just, again, completely and totally unacceptable because we know that children lack the cognitive ability to decipher whether something is an advertisement and influencer marketing is inherently manip manipulative uh, to kids. The same thing was true on television. It's true over here. We have to move the same values from television over uh, to the internet uh, or else the same exploitative policies uh, will be adopted uh, by marketers. Research also finds that your algorithms send teen users into a spiral <clears throat> of harmful content, including misinformation about COVID and ads for diet pills and appetite suppressants. Ms. Davis, will you commit that Facebook will not launch any platforms targeting children that employ algorithms promoting this dangerous content? Thank you, Senator Markey. We actually don't allow weight loss ads to be shown to people under the age of 18 already. Okay, well then th that's, that's reassuring because that content shouldn't exist anywhere on your platform. Uh, your platforms, uh, however, from my perspective, are actively promoting these materials. And we can't let that happen to kids. So you seem to disagree with whether or not you are doing that, but my research says that you are. So that's also something that I think we should just codify. Um, if Facebook has taught us anything, it's that self-regulation is not an option. Uh, we need rules, rules that uh, are federally uh, mandated that have to be adhered to by uh, companies. And that's why today I am reintroducing the Kids Internet Design and Safety Act, the Kids Act, uh, partnering with Senator Blumenthal, who I thank uh, for uh, working with me on this bill. Our legislation bans damaging website design features like follower counts, autoplay, and push alerts that are harmful to kids. Limits advertising and commercial content like product placement and influencer marketing to kids, and prohibits amplification of harmful and violent content to kids. 